All right, Shalom. Shalom. <clears throat> all right, first and foremost, we want to give our praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh. All right, double honors to the elders, apostles at GMS, salutations and blessings to the Akim around the world, preaching and teaching is true. All right, with the GMS Memphis camp, I'm Yakanan. I'm Anand. Okay, and uh, I'm going to let the brother break down the lesson. But uh, Lord willing, it's edifying for the elect. Yeah, the name of this lesson is <clears throat> Mysteries Are Revealed to the Meek. You know, who are the meek? Really, the prophets. You know, the lowly, uh, the lowly, the humble. And those are the mysteries who are given to, man. You know, so it's funny, what we're going to get into it. Come. Okay. Uh, it's Matthew, it's chapter 18, right? Yeah. Come, uh, Matthew 18, verses 3 and 4. Yeah. And said, Fairly I say unto you, except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven. Right, because exactly, man. In order for you to um, receive these mysteries and um, get into the kingdom of heaven, you got to become like a little children. You got to mm -hmm. repent. Mm -hmm. You got to convert. <clears throat> you got to put off that old man, what you once knew. You know? Mm -hmm. Start um, coming back to the law, that's commandments. The true baptism, man. Unless you've been converted, man. That's right. That's right. Uh, verse 4. Whosoever therefore shall humble himself as this little child, the same is greatest in the kingdom of heaven. Right. So you got to humble yourself. Because one thing about a child, they humble. Uh -huh. You know, that's why I said train up as a child is the way it's, um, way it's going to not depart for thee. Uh -huh. Walking pale faces. But you right. jump to um, Matthew 21, 16. Come on. You get to what? Yes, sir. Yeah, 3 and 19. Okay. It's Matthew <clears throat> chapter 21, verse 16. Yep. And say unto him, Hearest thou what these say? And Yahweh said saith unto them, Yea, have ye never read out of the mouth of babes and sucklings thou hast perfected praise? Right, which um, Yahweh Shai was quoting from the Old Testament, man, which was Psalms, I think the 8th chapter, let me see. Psalms 8 and, uh, let's see. I'm going to ask the slide here. Let me see. Uh, Mark 6, I want to say Psalms the 8th chapter, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see. Let me see. This, the book of Psalms 8 and, um, uh, I'll start at verse 1. O Lord, our she's like, O Lord, our Lord, how excellency, how how excellent is thy name in mm -hmm. all that earth, who has set the glory above the heavens, out of the mouth of babes and suckling, which were children, which were the prophets, man. You know? It said, Out of the mouth of babes and sucklings hast thou ordained strength because of thy enemies, that thou mightest steal the enemy in, in the avenger, man. You know, but this, you, so you read that again? Come on. It's Matthew 21 and 16. And say it unto him, Hearest thou what these say? And Yahweh shall say it unto them, Yeah, have ye never read? Right, have you never read mm -hmm. out of the book? Mm -hmm. Letting you know that Yahweh shall, the New Testament came from the Old Testament. Man. That's right. You know? That's right. Go ahead. Come on. Out of the mouth of babes and sucklings, thou hast perfected praise. Right, out of the mouth of babes, thou hast perfected perfective uh, praise, right. man. And guess mm -hmm. what? We give our praises to you. How about Shema man? Daily, man. <laughs> That's right. By the, the videos going up. And this is who the message we're giving to. The babes, the children, man. Mm -hmm. You know? Come you get this. I got, I got yeah. a precept. I'll go ahead, huh? Yeah, go this ahead. uh First Peter 2 and 2. It says, As newborn babes desire the sincere milk of the word, that, that ye may grow thereby. Right, you need the milk, man. Mm -hmm. When you uh, you can't get into uh, deep breakdown mm -hmm. when you just now coming into this, man. You need the basics, you know, the basic fundamentals, you know, right. like uh, the color scriptures, the Lord's mm -hmm. name, yep, the Lord's judgment, Lord yeah. control both sides, you know, that's the milk, yeah. you know. And those yeah. are mysteries. Yeah, right? but that milk, those milk scriptures are deep, though. That's right. You know, when, especially, man, when you coming out of the world, man, just though. Little basic scriptures, man, can can uh, uh, teach you a lot. It'll put you head head over heels over uh, a Christian, man. That's you right, know, bro. Uh, most of the people in the world. That's right. Oh, you got it, bro. Oh, you get that Sirach. <clears throat> this is a uh, this is Sirach three and nineteen. It says, uh, "Many are in high place and of re uh, renown." But mysteries are revealed unto the meek. Right, mysteries are revealed to the meek. Uh -huh. You know, oh, you got the blue lead on your phone? Come on, I can get it. Okay, you keep going up. It says, For the power of the Lord is great, and he is honored of the lowly. But he is honored of the Lord, and those who the mysteries are given to, man. Right. The meek, man. 
Chris said, many are uh, reading from the top again. Like this says, many are in a are in high place. Like, look at these celebrities, man. They ain't, they got high status. Yeah. Uh -huh. But guess what? Lord ain't dealing with them, man. Uh -huh. He dealing with the meat. Like I said in Isaiah, unto this man would I look of, of, of a contrite spirit, uh -huh. a broken hearted man. Those was the meek, those was the lowly, those was the humble. Uh -huh. You know, uh -huh. those the little children, man. You know, that's why you when I first coming in, you told me be like a sponge to soak things up, man. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. Hey, because you gotta you gotta throw away everything you've been taught in the world, man. And if you if you got a high mind or a proud spirit, you're not the, the Lord not gonna be able to suck with you, man. You gotta be meek and lowly in order to be able to accept it so the Lord can uh, uh deal with you, you yeah. know, and retrain you. <laughs> retrain everything you, you, you thought that you knew. God. You know? It says, uh, but mysteries are revealed unto the meat. Yep. The mysteries are revealed to the meat. That's plain and simple. All right. So this uh first Corinthians one. I'ma start at um twenty six, which is a bad chapter, you know. You start at like nineteen if you want. But this uh first Corinthians one and twenty six, for you see your calling brethren, how that how that not many wise men after the flesh, not many mighty not many noble are called. Uh -huh. You see, we we'll just go back to that. Yep. You know, but it said, but the Most High had chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise. The Most High had chosen the weak things of the world to confound the things which are mighty, which is what the lowly man, uh -huh. the foolish man. Uh -huh. It said, in the base things of the world, in things which are despised, had the Most High chosen, yet in things which are not to bring to now. Things that are, that no flesh shall glory in his presence, man. All right. Hey, because, hey, uh, that's that's how Yahweh Shai going to get his glory, man. Mm -hmm. You know? He going to take he gonna take the lowly, the meek, the humble of, the, of, of, of this society, man, and confound those who are supposed to be on a high level, man. Who are supposed to, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Be like some 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 big shot, you know, God. but they looking at us like we nobodies, man. But hey, the Lord is, is dealing with dealing with those men, man. The scripture's telling you that, man. That's yep. right, bro. <clears throat> I got a quick precept. Go ahead. It's Isaiah 29 and 19. The meek also shall increase their joy in the Lord, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. And the poor among men shall rejoice in the Holy One of Israel. Mm. Ooh. Hey, that's why I said the prophet, <coughs> whether he be rich or poor, mm -hmm. they, they glory is, is to fear the Lord, man. God. You know, that was said when the rich man speak it, they stole it to the crowds. Yeah. You know, but when a poor man speak, they despise it, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and guess what? We are those poor men. But mm -hmm. the book of Matthew, the fifth chapter said, blessed are the poor in spirit, for there's the kingdom of heaven. <laughs> right. And that's the mystery. People mm -hmm. don't understand that. Right. People don't understand <laughs> that or uh, why is the Lord dealing with lowly men. Right. Uh -huh. You know, but we know why. Because right. they say knowledge poking it up. That's right. You know, mm -hmm. most I ain't dealing with them, man. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And if I may add, who who puffed up? Are, are Christians puffed up? Mm -hmm. They, they think they already got it, right? That high mountain, right? Yep. Yep. Come on. Did you want me to get the word meek from the blue that I or what do you want me to for you? Uh, what do you want me to get? Mystery in you know, uh, first Corinthians two and seven. Come on, somebody. Um you get that Matthew eleven twenty five. Uh, but this uh first Corinthians two and um uh, six. How be it we speak wisdom among them that are prophet, yet not the wisdom of this world nor of the princes of this world, they come to naught. Why? Because, hey, it's, it's, it's going to come to naught, man. You know, what's that? This wisdom, hell is devil, devilish, you know? It ain't set from above. It said, but we speak the wisdom of the Mosai in a mystery, even the hidden wisdom which the Mosai ordained before the world unto our glory, which none of the princes of this world knew. But had they known it, they would not have crucified the Lord, Yahweh, of glory. You want to speak up? Right, you got it, bro. All right, I'm going to read it again. First Corinthians 2 and 8. Which none of this prince, so like which none of the princes of this world mm -hmm. knew. But had they known it, they would not have crucified the Lord, Yahweh, of glory, man. So if uh -huh. they knew, if they really knew who Yahweh, Shah was at that time, they would have not crucified him, man. Right. But it had to be fulfilled for uh because of the scripture, because uh -huh. of Yahweh was, man. Uh -huh. You know, they would have uh, crucified the Lord, gave him up, you know. Uh -huh. Yeah. This, and that's a mystery, man. That's right, bro. We understand why, you know, because, hey, I want to say, um, you get, um, 
Isaiah. What do you say? Oh, the most I blinded them. No, it gets 2 uh, Corinthians 4 yeah, 3. Second Corinthians. Yeah. Yep. But you get that mystery. <clears throat> it's a mystery in the blue letter. Strong's G 3466. Mustadion. Mustadion. Mustadion, go ahead. And it means hidden thing, secret, mystery, and um, a hidden or secret thing not obvious to the understanding. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go to the Strong's. Yep. Okay. To shut the mouth, a secret or mystery through the idea of silence imposed by initiation into re religious rites. And who initiated? The prophets, mm -hmm. man. That's right. Like you read Jeremiah, the fourth chapter, say, Now nah, I am a child, but I have ordained you a prophet unto the nations. Right. You know? Mm -hmm. But keep going. It's one that say, Not given to ordinary mortals. Yeah. Come, come. Um, a hidden purpose or counsel of the most high, the secret counsels which govern the most high in dealing with the righteous, which are hidden from ungodly and wicked men, but plain to the godly. Plain to the godly, man. Uh -huh. You know, there's a moment. I read on, um, hey, generally mysteries, religious secrets confided only to the initiated and not to ordinary mortals. Mm. Mm. See, not uh -huh. given to ordinary mortals, man. Come. The Lord will be be uh, the elect number, the first fruits. Come. You know? That's, right, That's why the world don't understand this. This why the world don't understand you how it's shot. Uh -huh. All they know is false gods and idols, you know Jesus Christ. They don't mm -hmm. understand it, you know? Yep. They don't understand why we went to slavery, you know, uh, uh -huh. you know, basic, you know, milk. That's right, the milk. But that's uh -huh. a mystery, man. <laughs> the milk. Uh -huh. Hey, give Romans eleven and seven. <clears throat> you got it up. All right, this is uh this is second Corinthians four. And three, it says, but if our gospel be hid, it is hid to them that are lost. Quite the good news, man. Go ahead. It says, in whom the God of this world have blinded the minds of them which believe not. Right. God of this world blind the minds of them which believe not. Right. Who the God of this world? Satan. Uh -huh. yep. Esau. Esau, this time, man. Uh -huh. Esau blind our people, man. Ultimately, the Lord blinded them, man. That's right. That's right, you bro. Know? It says, least the light of the glorious gospel of Hamashiach, who is the image of the Most High, should shine unto them. Right. Unless, uh, unless the young Yahweh shine, unless they part of it. Right. Mm -hmm. we, yep. Go ahead. Come on, it's Romans 11 and 7. What then? Israel hath not obtained that which he seeketh for, but the election hath obtained it, and the rest were blinded. Right, the election had obtained it, and the rest mm -hmm. were blinded. Keep Come going. Come on, verse 8. That's why two-thirds don't get it, man. Mm -hmm. That's why I don't mm -hmm. understand Yahweh mm -hmm. shine. God. Verse 8, according as it is written, the most high Yahweh by showing how Shah hath given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear unto this day. To this day, mm -hmm. man. They don't understand it. They don't yeah. understand why um we went slaving, mm -hmm. you know. God. Little yeah. stuff like that. Why well, the so called white man is, is over over us right mm -hmm. now. Why we can't come together. Why Definitely. we can't come no, together. The curses. Yeah. Don't That's understand right. the curses, That's man. Curses. Why yeah. we live paycheck to paycheck. Yeah. But it's a mystery. mystery. It's yeah. a mystery. Yeah. Hey, Amos 3 and 7. Yeah. Come on, I can get that. I'm holding it. Come on, it's Amos 3 and 7. Surely the Lord, Yahweh Shah Shemi Yahweh power will do nothing but he revealeth his secret unto his servants, the prophets. He revealeth his secret unto his servants, the prophets. So mm -hmm. if you can understand those secrets, man, it's a, it's a good <laughs> chance the Lord might be dealing with you. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? We we say hopefully that. Mm -hmm. You it's know, we don't up. get proud and be like, yeah, I know I'm, I know I'm the elect. Mm -hmm. I know I'm going to make it. No, nah, we don't know. But, right. hey, hey, we, we know that we're understanding these things. We know the Lord is dealing with us through <clears throat> through what? These mysteries, man. God. These secrets that are being revealed unto us. Mm -hmm. We can understand it, but everybody mm -hmm. else, they, they, it, it's, it's still a mystery to them. They, they, they can't get it. Yeah, that's why it's a blessing. You know, this truth is a blessing, man. That's right. You know, mm -hmm. hey, the Passover come up. Mm -hmm. Not too many people, you know, finna keep the Passover, that's man. That's right. They're finna go out that yep. Friday, Friday night, night. party and bullshit, party yep. and get high. Yep. Yep. Commit adultery and yep. so on, man. Yep. Mm -hmm. Not knowing it's hastening, man. The past over tomorrow, man. <laughs> Not too many people doing it, but hey, for us, it's a blessing, man. That's right. Blessing. So, really, we can uh, keep it you know, the best of my ability and true sincerity, you know? Mm -hmm. Right. Hey, you got groups out here keeping it on the wrong uh, uh, day. And then try to turn the Passover into like a, a lamb dinner, man. Mm -hmm. a, fashion uh, a, a fashion show, a festival, mm -hmm. man. Charging $200. 
Come yeah, on. Yeah, huh? <laughs> I mean, come on, man. <laughs> and this Matthew 11, 25, um, you get Matthew 13, 10. Uh -huh. Be close. Uh -huh. Come on. Uh -huh. uh -huh. This Matthew 11, 25. At that time, how shall I answer and said, I thank thee, O Father, Lord of heaven and earth, because thou hast hid these things from the wise and prudent, and has revealed them unto babes. Right, mm -hmm. reveal them into babes, man, mm -hmm. and that's that's us, man. That's right. We are those babes, man, that that the Lord revealed the secrets to. You know, we we're, we're the ones that that's in that meek and that humble spirit, man. Mm -hmm. That spirit that you have to be in in order for you have a shot to sup with you and and uh, reveal His secrets unto you, man. You know. All right. So, it's on, yeah. it's on Matthew chapter, it's on Matthew chapter thirteen, verses ten and eleven. And the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? Verse 11. He answered and said unto them, Because it is given unto you to know the mysteries. But well, given unto who? The prophets, the, uh, his disciples. That's right. Mm -hmm. No? Good. Yeah. Given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them it is not given. Well, mm -hmm. to them it's not given because mm -hmm. they are blinded. Mm -hmm. God of this world blinded. They, they, they can't see the microchip, the mm -hmm. MOB. Mm -hmm. They don't understand that. You know, yeah. they don't understand what time we're living in. They don't understand why um, Esau throwing away free money. Mm -hmm. right. yep. They don't understand this place getting hit by thermonuclear missiles. That's right. So, but hey, these mysteries is was given unto us, man, for mm -hmm. the kingdom of heaven, man. Come on. So it's a blessing at the end of the day, man. That's right, bro. So, hey, we gonna close it up. All right, hey. So with that, Lord willing, it was an edifying lesson for the elect. Once again, we want to give our praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Rakakudash. All right, double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS. Say, taste and blessed to the elect. Shalom. Shalom.